Kill him. Hey, what is up everyone? Chadlings Gaming here, and today I am back with a brand new The Hunter Call of the Wild video, and in today's video I'm going to be doing a tutorial, or should I say, the best spots for the Ibex goats. So first of all, I just want to clear out that I want to do a huge thank you to uh, that we gained and we reached 200 subscribers on the channel. I want to thank every single one of you and uh, I really hope this channel gets somewhere and um, I'm watching the videos as much as I enjoy making them. So to start off, um, I just want to say that I did buy <laughs> quite a lot of DLCs actually because I bought like, I don't know, five, six different DLCs and I also bought this map. So I do have the M1 um grand the muzzle loader also i bought the map that i'm at right now where the ibex goats are so this map offers um the 6.5 millimeter light cool things and i also want to show you guys my trophy lodge at the end of the video so i hope you guys stay tuned um i actually don't have a lot of animals in it yet but um i mean it's still interesting i did get a diamond ibex goat so uh, if you guys want to stay tuned and uh, look at my trophy lodge after at the end of the video i will show you guys and uh yeah so i'll show you guys the ibex well i think it's the best spot in the game for the ibex goats and uh it's right in it's right this little lake right here in mirador over here on this side drinking zone and i had a lot of luck for ibex goats and they are usually at dawn they're usually active during dawn i checked in codex and uh yeah so we're gonna hunt here during dawn and um hopefully we can get a diamond or something because i killed a diamond right here in the drinking zone and last time i came down here there's no joke 30 ibex goats so hopefully we get some luck and I will keep you guys updated and again I do want to make a big and huge thank you to all of you who support the channel I will still be making one video per week I am presently busy with work and in my life right now with school and everything but I will try my best and post every single week probably once or twice but I'll keep you guys updated let's just get right in the video and of course <laughs> We got a mouflon male right when i start so uh hopefully oh no that's the wrong weapon i do not want to i also haven't been playing this game so so much these days i've been grinding a little bit on red dead redemption i don't know if you guys seem interested in that in red dead redemption um videos i would be interested in posting some but that only depends if you guys want to watch that or only the hunter called the wild i like both so i mean oh is that the one no we got a female you can see already we got a lot of of goats and ibex goats and mouflons which i can't spot right now maybe that one will oh no that was a horrible shot maybe that one will run in the open and I do not see it hit that one again and we have a female I think that's female no that's male actually hit him I'm telling you this spot is really insane with ibex and these goats actually give quite a lot of money you guys be surprised on how much money they actually give but um yeah they do give a lot of money and uh this spot is just insane there's always ibex all over the place and we've got two females right there running she's dropped that was a miss that was a hit there's gonna be a new which I'm really excited about, and you guys probably do know the news. Um, the Hunter Call of the Wild are going to be getting out the turkeys. 
which I'm really looking forward to. Um, they're going to get a whole new little update they're going to set up, and I'm really looking forward to it. And we got a mail. Heart shot, maybe? Ooh, perfect. Are you guys hunting right here around this lake? You guys will get a lot of kills. And these animals give, like, towards, I think it ranges between some like 600 to 1,000, even 1,200. And of course, I did get a heart shot on that uh, male. Yeah, I don't know how far, 135 meters away. Not bad, heart shot with the 30 odd six, as you guys can see. Guys, I'm just hearing some all over me right now. And um, I'm seeing some all over the place. <laughs> like, it's really crazy. Um, this is the hot spot for Ibex Goat. Okay, level 3. Yeah, he is. Oh, no vital organ hit. Wow. Look at them horns. Oh, that's a nice one. Heart shot. And the... And there's another. I'm pretty sure I, I hit that last shot on the, um, the other female. Oh, that was a 300. No. Oh, no. Well, I mistaken with the wrong gun. That one also is a nice one. Level 3. That I'd show you guys the best Ibex spot in the game. And even if you guys... Because I know Ibex hunting in this game is not as popular. But, um... You guys should really look forward to it. I know a lot of people did, like don't hunt this animal as much, but uh, you, you guys should really look forward at the map Quatro Colinas for the Ibex goats, because it's really insane here. And okay, so here we go. We've got oh. That one was a horrible shot. And there's some also always going up the mountains, which is, they are very easy to kill. As you can see, you just take them out one by one. And uh, there we go. Maybe a third. Please. Nope, that was a clean miss. I'm surprised that oh and there he goes he was actually a pretty nice one and we've got of course like a couple right here that one's pretty nice one's down and oh this is the gold we just shot a left a right lung hit as you guys can see 1211 cash for a gold ibex so it really gives a lot of cash and you guys already know it i did show you guys a nice spot for these and like i said there's just a lot so if you guys want to make quick and easy money in the hunter call of the wild i really consider you guys hunting in um cuatro the cuatro map i don't <laughs> i can't really spell it actually but i really consider you guys hunting here and uh you guys will just make a large amount of cash and have at the same time fun since i mean you guys can hunt diamonds i killed a diamond the other day here since there's so many, um, as you guys can see, another gold. Pretty cool. Another silver. 1,000 and 100 cash. That was just the silver, so. Alright, so here we are. Um, starting off, I just want to say to you guys, um, I haven't really... I, th I just bought the... Um, trophy Lodge, which is pretty funny because I've been playing this game since it came out, but uh, I did just recently bought it, so we're starting off here with um, I don't even know how these are called with um, two 
brown hybrid um, Canada geese right here two of them right at the start right when you enter and then I've got a diamond moose which is pretty cool actually he's almost his core is almost at 300 uh, 300 but yeah that's my diamond moose that I got in Yukon Valley I also have a um, red deer which is a diamond also and I got a gold bison right here I haven't got my hands on a diamond bison yet but pretty nice either way I wanted to keep him um, I've got wolves here and I got a blonde uh, red brown I mean <laughs> but yeah that one that was a nice fur type wolf right there and also I've got the um, fur malistic uh, mallard duck which they're pretty rare to find actually they're pretty cool um, I also have a um, piebald mallard duck which is also pretty cool and of course I know some of you guys have pretty much way cooler lodges but for me it's just a start for now so and this is what I was talking about this is my diamond ibex that I got on uh, the spot that I showed you guys which almost scores 200 but yeah that's my diamond ibex um, that I shot at the spot that I told you guys for this video this is the diamond ibex they're just huge their horns are just huge and it's pretty cool also I also have a albino whitetail female I kept her because everyone keeps albinos I guess which is cool. I got a male. I think I was a gold though. Gold. Um, black bear. That's a black bear. That's not a grizzly. Yeah. Black bear. But I don't really. I, I think that's pretty much it honestly. It's really just a start. But um, I mean it's, it's just cool overall. I do have another wolf here. But I haven't really played a lot upstairs. Um, I do have a blonde mallard duck which is also pretty cool but like I said it's the start so I as you guys can see it's pretty much all empty and I really hope in the future I can make this place really awesome really cool as always and uh, I yeah so leave a comment what videos you guys want to see in the future what videos do you guys want to watch in general um, what the hunter videos or tutorials you guys want to see I will respond to every single comment like I always do. And uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, and uh, see you next time.